Hi, my name is Jenny Wojciechowski and I teach church history here at Luther Seminary. <laughs> I haven't seen either. I should say I should say Oppenheimer because I'm a historian, but actually I really, really want to see Barbie. <laughs> I would say find a group of other women to support each other. Um, it is it's a rewarding thing, but it can be challenging for women. Um, so just surround yourself with other women who understand what you're going through and support each other. All right, this is a bit of a story. Um, so I wasn't raised in the church. And when I was in kind of early to mid 20s, uh, I found Jesus. And something, if you take my classes, this won't be a surprise to you. Um, if I'm gonna do something, I wanna be really sure about it. I really wanna understand it. And so um, I decided that I should take a couple Bible classes because when you aren't raised in the church and you open the Bible, it's like really confusing. Um, so I was like, I'm going to take one New Testament class and then I'm going to get it and it's going to be fine. Um, and it was wild. Um, the admissions office where I went called back and they're like, we think you're a really good candidate for seminary. They threw a scholarship at me. And so I always say I accidentally went to seminary. Um, and it was a very strange experience because I was a brand new Christian like learning with all of these pastors and all these like people who had been walking in the faith for so long um so on the one hand like i learned from not only my professors but all my classmates and that was really great um but on the other hand um i felt very out of place um because that wasn't my story that wasn't who i was i was so learning um, i was so new to it the most dreaded thing was apply this to your ministry. And I'm like, what ministry? Like, I, I'm a brand new Christian. I don't know. Um, so I don't know. I would say hang in there, you. <laughs> it'll, it'll turn out in the end. Um, you know, God put me where I was supposed to be, even though there was times when I really doubted it during seminary, probably over a coffee or tea. I've recently had to drastically cut down my caffeine intake, but I'm still... Uh, <laughs> I can get a decaf or a tea or something. So that's a great way to get to know me. All right, so I've been doing a lot of reading of mystical texts for a book I'm writing. Um, so I'll start there. Um, I would say probably one of my favorites that I read recently was On Loving God by Bernard of Clairvaux. That one was really wonderful. Um, I somewhat recently read my daughter the entire Lord of the Rings trilogy. Uh, that was pretty awesome. Um, and I'm reading my son, um, The Phantom Tollbooth right now. <sighs> I haven't done karaoke in a very long time, but when I was young, it was always Love Shack. <laughs> the summers. The summers are so beautiful, it almost makes up for the winters. Almost. Almost. <laughs> almost <laughs> makes up for it. <laughs> All right, well, I'm teaching two sections of History 1, which you have to take. So, I mean, I can, I can pitch that. They're fun, I promise. It's more exciting than you think. Um, and then I'm teaching a brand new class on Christian mysticism in the winter. And then I have my elective on women's history in the spring, which is always a fun one too. All right, I do have fun, I swear. Um, I, I really like to cook. Um, that's the thing. I, am, I play the banjo poorly. Um, I didn't even, I, I know I should have brought my banjo, but I was afraid you'd make me play it because um, I'm not very good. <laughs> um, I love hanging out with my kids, my family. Uh, this summer they've been home, so it's been swimming and different things with them. Um, going on vacation with them, those are some of the things I really enjoy. I weight lift. That's kind of, people find that very unexpected. <laughs> I, I'm a pretty avid, like, I'm really into fitness and I do like weight training and things. I can do chin-ups, which is pretty unusual for women to do. And so if I really want to impress somebody, <laughs> I'll do a chin -up. And I can do good push-ups too. Just remember, this is such an exciting time. You're going to learn so much and just really try to immerse yourself in it. It can be a hectic time, um, but just remember to ground yourself in God and remember why you're here. Um, and, you know, there's a lot of people here who are rooting for you and feel free to contact any of us um, if you're struggling, but just persevere and it's, it's a great time.